is so much happening in Canva at the moment. So many improvements. I'm just going to cover one today, which is text to image. If you haven't used it before, it's a great app to try that uses artificial intelligence or AI to create images from your thoughts. Hi, I'm Kim from Be Your Own Graphic Designer and a Canva champion. Let's go over to my Canva design screen and see the new updates. I've loaded a simple end scram post, and now I'm going to go to my apps over here on the left side. And you can see, because I've been looking at text to image, it's coming up at the top. I'm going to click on this. It says type whatever you want and see it come to life. So I was recently away and I was looking at birds. I'm going to do an eagle. I'm going to type eagle. When I first recorded this, it was in beta, using this amazing AI technology to create images. You now get four options of images when you actually go to create. But first of all, you need to choose your style. And these have all been updated. So you can have a painting style, a photo style, concept art, drawing 3D, or a pattern. And the aspect ratio is also made very clear for you. So you've got square, landscape, or portrait. And obviously I've got a square image as I've done an Instagram post. I now just need to choose my style and we can do this as a photo. And then click create your image. It does take a little bit of time, not too long. Oh, I've got some stunning photographs here. I'm going to click on that one. Let's put it up to make it larger so you can see it. Now my husband who's a bird watcher will probably tell me that this isn't actually a golden eagle, but I think it looks stunning anyway. Let's go back to the apps and try it in a different style. Canva has made it very clear that they're still evolving this new technology. So if the images don't seem quite right, to report it to them. I don't want to create a game because create a game will just give me more of the same. So I'm going to start over and try it with a different effect. Paste in my information again. And let's do this as a drawing this time. And then click create your image. And here we have drawings. I'm going to choose this one. As well as getting four image choices for all the different designs you want, you used to only be able to have 25 images a day. Now it's increased to 100. So I could play with this for a very long time. But I'll show you the end results so you can see all the different styles for that same text. Now let's try it as 3D. These are the six different styles you can have, and you can keep going. And now you have a choice of up to 100 images a day. It gives you plenty to choose from. I hope that helps, and I'll see you next week.